I get it. I get it. That gets you fired up. Kind of like a Nine Inch Nails vibe slightly. Yeah, almost. This is a great music for like a bad boy pro baseball player to come out to. Spit on the ground. Now batting. Right. For the Houston Astros. Yeah. One of the last guys in the league still chewing. Yeah. I don't follow baseball anymore. I don't know if anyone still chews tobacco. 6'5", 245 pounds. They don't announce that when you're going to bat. (laughs) That'd be amazing. (laughs) Now batting for the Minnesota Twins, Chuck Knobloch, 5'3", 160. (laughs) They don't do that in baseball? Wait, but I feel like I've been to a baseball game. Boxing? Okay, but I feel like I've been to a baseball game where they, on the screen... They might say the guy's Oh, yeah, weight. they might have that on the screen, but they don't announce it. <laughs> okay, well, I think... So many baseball players are just like... <laughs> now batting, John Crook. 5'11", 280 pounds. <laughs> like... <sighs> Shout out to Imagine Dragons. Oh, my God. I also want to point out to a lot of people out there who think it's Imagination Dragons, it's Imagine Dragons. You could keep that extra syllable to, to yourself. Ezra, if you were a major league ball player, what would you be your walk up music? Besides Imagine Dragons, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a believer. You're trying to be serious, like if I randomly was actually good at baseball and I was still myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you were just like really good. If I just had like a You got drafted out of high school. If I had like a rookie of the year scenario, I like broke my arm and then my I suddenly my pitch got crazy. You were the top rated <laughs> Pitcher in high school. Okay, all right, but that, that gets confusing because then I'm like, well, who am I? No, 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 no. How did I get so good? I want to <laughs> pay no, me but, the picture. Okay, still your same taste in music. Okay, and then you're like 21 and you're a rookie on the New York okay, Yankees. Okay, if you, I'm trying to be really so sincere, take, take this seriously. It, realistically, if I had randomly been great at baseball, yeah, and then I somehow was like, yeah, playing for the Yankees at 21, yeah, probably my thing. Especially back then, in the mid-2000s, I would have to be the hipster baseball player. Well, I would have two choices. Because around that same time in my life, I was getting interested in preppy fashion. So either I could have started a preppy band, or I could have been the preppy baseball Yeah, maybe hipster versus preppy baseball player. Because, yeah, other guys have so much personality. It might be based on where they're from, if they're from another country. Yeah. You know, that can be part of sure. the mystique, some of them. Or even if they're from America, there's the kind of like... Guy who could be like from down south, Kenny yeah. Powers type dude. Yeah. But for me, you know, I'm just a guy from, you know, New Jersey playing for the Yankees. If I really want to make a splash, I'd have to kind of come out. So yeah, I would have the choice between being the hipster Yankee or the preppy Yankee. Either way, I'd be kind of like a villain. So I might as well play it up kind of like professional wrestling style. I actually probably know more about the WWE than I know about baseball anyway. So I would be the preppy Yankee. And I would wear like a pink polo shirt under my Yankees uniform and pop it. Not an option. <laughs> and I would come, I would come out. Ownership's gonna <laughs> lose their like mind. Super WWE. This is like super pro wrestling. When I would come out after like you know Kenny Powers comes out. So you're a pitcher. Comes to no no. I'm, well, this is me coming to bat. Okay, yeah, you're. A so hit. after Kenny Powers comes out and strikes out to Imagination Dragons, then I come out and then. They just play like some classical music, like the masterpiece theater oh music. Oh my god! But then also, before, you have a, you have a, a tray with grape poupon no, on yeah, it. Yeah, no. But also, before I come out, <laughs> my butler, I get like my buddy to dress up as a butler, and he comes out. He has a, like a little brush, and he like brushes the plate for me. Oh my! And god. then he kind of like brushes my way as I come, and I say like thank you. Everybody's just booing. It's like oh. I hate that guy. And then I'm like kind of listening and I'm just kind of like, I, you know, I'm just being like up like a pro wrestler. I'm like looking at the crowd. I'm like, oh, you don't like me? Oh, I don't care. <laughs> and then I'll be saying like, very good, Jeeves. You may leave. And then I knock it out of the park and everybody's no. like, oh, I hate this guy. Then you pop up to second base. <laughs> That's the problem. That's why baseball players can't do that stuff. Because they like are always just like Wait, what striking. Does it, what does that mean to pop up to second base? Like you just like hit a pop up. Oh, and then they and the second baseman just catches like this is the most undramatic ending to an Wait, at bat. Why baseball? 
There's no way you people, could do... People find baseball so boring. Wouldn't it be so funny if baseball players could but this be is what I'm more saying. like wrestlers? I love the idea. Yeah. I think it's hilarious. But the problem is you can't front like that and then you're failing at best like 67% of the time. Right, because... Because like... In, like the, in wrestling, you can choreograph what yeah, happens. Yeah. And, but like the best baseball players are still going to like strike out, ground out, whatever. And so like after all that sort of pomp and circumstance, you can't just like ground out on the second pitch. Right. Well, you we, just look like an idiot. Yeah. Okay. We would start have to, we'd have every to start, at bat. Imagine how, right. We would have to start making baseball fake. You have like 600 at bats a year. We, every <laughs> time the ball, the ball comes, comes out. out. I was just, you know, imagine <laughs> that, that I was like, and I was like, like a funny name. People I say was, baseball's long now. Right. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> <It's> like <laughs> the game has become five hours with all this like pomp and circumstance. Make baseball fake. Yeah. My baseball title, I'm, I'm Lord Hadaway. Oh my God. That's my name. So then they're like, at, at bat, 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 bat. <laughs> at six at, feet at tall, feet tall, tall, tall. Or how much do I weigh? 165, 165 pounds. pounds. You're bulked up. I'm bulked up at that 185. point. 185. 185 pounds, pounds pure, pure muscle. Pure muscle. Lord had away. It's like an away game. We're playing in Boston. The Red Sox fans is like, oh god, I hate this guy. <laughs> Just like I come out like, oh what's that? What did you say? You're in the dugout later with your homemade grape ice cream. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Just- <laughs> Just like, I've, got, I've got like a little scarf on and the camera's pitching like it looks like Lord Hadaway's eating some homemade grape ice cream. My butler's right next to me. Yo, ba- that would be so sick if baseball was more like that. After every home run that Lord Hadaway hits, <laughs> he hits his grape ice cream no, as yeah. a celebratory no, like- <laughs> scoop. I knock it right out of the park. Knock it right out of (laughs) that expression. (laughs) I like your ease with baseball lingo. It's like nineteen twenties. You knock it right out of the park. I knock it I knock it right I knock it right out of the park and everybody's like home run and everybody in Boston is like groaning, like, oh my god, I hate the Yankees and I especially hate Lord Attaway. And then everybody's like, All right. And I'm just standing there. Like the umpire's like, All right, round the bases. Round the bases, Lord Hadaway, and I'm just like putting my finger like, one minute. The butler comes <laughs> back out <laughs> with the grape ice cream, and I just like have to take a few spoonfuls, like, and I just, I very slowly walk around. Just people are just like throwing bananas at me. Let's make baseball fake. Fake baseball with more characters. There could be a guy who comes out, he's like a knight, he bats with like a sword. <laughs> there could be like, Bats with a sword. There could be like scary guys like the Undertaker. Maybe his baseball bat is like looks like it's like a bone. It's got face paint. Maybe like on. a relief pitcher that comes in and like douses the ball in gas. And oh, lights it. Yeah, it's just a it. fireball. Maybe we could do like Summer League, like Cape Cod Summer League. Except it's like Cape Cod, dude. It's Ezra and Jake Time Crisis presents fake baseball. And it's just like people yeah, throwing the balls on fire. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Animals. Dudes are in armor. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, I love this idea. Okay. <laughs> the number three song.